Hi, I'm Dan the Jamaican, and this is a Black Ops 2 gameplay on Pod. I'm going to be talking about why I think Call of Duty is slowly dying. Now, a lot of people haven't liked the last three Call of Duties, Call of Duty Ghosts, Black Ops 2, and Modern Warfare 3. Now, out of the three, I think two of them were, have, were really bad, and are the worst two in the series that I've played. And those two are Ghosts and Modern Warfare 3, so this... In my opinion, this this proves why Infinity Ward are no longer capable of making Call of Duty anymore. But you can give your views to that. Now, Black Ops 2, I felt, had potential, but they messed up in some areas. So I thought it was actually quite good. But uh, a lot of people did think of it negatively as well. I, I look over the negatives and I actually see quite a fun game. So I personally didn't like, I didn't dislike it that much. So nothing wrong with it, in my opinion. But nothing majorly wrong with it, apart from the lag. Um, anyway, um... Well, the reason I think Call of Duty is is dying is like it's not dying like as in it's going to it's going to finish really quickly. This might be what the video seems like. I mean, it's gradually coming to like it's 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 coming to a, it's declining and it's soon not going to be the it's soon going to be barely number one or it's not going to be number one shooter anymore. I think they'll keep making them, but not as many people buy them. Um, soon, in the next three years, you wait. There's not going to be that many people buying them. Um, now, my main reasons for this is the sales have gone down. The amount of people playing online has gone down dramatically. Um, the maps getting samey. The kill streaks, well, the, mm, the score streaks they're changing a little bit, I guess. But things are just getting too similar every single time. Now, maybe Sledgehammer are improving this a lot. They said they were trying to um, to be innovative and imaginative as well but I don't see this really happening very well um, I think yeah this is the approach they should make they should try and make the games as new as possible I actually think that should be how they do it but I just don't see that happening um, to be honest so yeah but I, I would prefer to see new games even if they're not quite the standard like they're on the first game but they'll improve on the second perhaps uh, I'd rather see that than games just very similar every single time. In a way, Black Ops 2 was kind of like that. It was kind of different to Call of Duty, the older ones, because it had score streaks. It had a really sort of customizable creator class system. And that was good to see, actually. So I, I actually don't think this game is that bad at all. So that's my personal opinion. A lot of people didn't like it. The graphics should be better. Um, there are, The maps could be a little bit better, I have to say. They're not great. Um, but for me, this game has been actually multiplayer wise it's actually one of the best I think I know a lot of people would agree with that and that's controversial but I actually do think it's very fun multiplayer wise zombies not great okay but not great not good enough in my opinion story was good that's why this is actually a decent Call of Duty in my opinion but there you go now I've mentioned the reasons why the game is dying and a lot of them are to do with the maps being me. a lot of them to do with the weapons the weapons are getting a little um, I know, I'd rather see the sort of retro weapons they had before, like the, the famous weapons like the AK-47, again back in multiplayer, uh, and stuff like that. You just, you just want to see the well-known weapons that are cool, maybe the MP40 back, but less overpowered. You just want to see weapons like that, that kind of, they're fun to use, and I don't know, everyone can use them without using attachments and stuff like that. Uh, I prefer those weapons, but it's all opinion again. Um, and I just think, you know, with Titanfall coming, I don't think Titanfall will be better than Call of Duty, be bigger, I don't, I don't think it's as good as Call of Duty actually, but um, yeah, I think there will be games out there, Battlefield is, is actually not taking advantage of the moment, I don't think, I think they need to improve their games a lot, um, so Call of Duty still probably has about one year, two years, but this, the others are actually catching up a lot. And the others being Battlefield, probably, pretty much, only Battlefield, actually. So the other main competitor, Battlefield, is almost as big as Call of Duty now. And so Call of Duty, basically, if the next two Call of Duty games are not good, I think the franchise will be behind Battlefield. That's my opinion. And that's when the game starts really going downhill, and, and maybe there'll be two or three more games after that. So potentially, if the games aren't good, the next two games... We could be seeing only five more years of Call of Duty. So that's why I've made this commentary. Um, I don't know what your opinions are. Maybe some of you think, oh, there might be even less games. But I think most of you think there'll be more games. But I honestly think five years, unless there's some, some major turnarounds in the franchise, will that'll be it. No one will buy their games. Because I, I personally, if Black Ops 3 is not good and Advanced Warfare is not good, I will not buy any more uh, Call of Duty games. 
I'll play. I'll find other things to play, or I'll, yeah, I'll try out the other franchises. I'll try out Battlefield. I'll try out whatever new stuff comes out. They're making lots of new things on the PS4 and Xbox One, so I don't really need to waste my time playing games which have got samey and, and not as good as they were originally as well. So that's my opinion on that. Feel free to comment. Feel free to to subscribe to see more videos like this. I do a lot of commentaries based on, you know. Gaming, gaming issues, um, things in Call of Duty that need to be improved. I don't know how I didn't get the kill there. I deserved that, I think. Um, stuff like that, and uh, that's what mainly what my channel is about. I sometimes do vlogs and stuff, silly vlogs. Um, uh, what else do I do? I do. I have done montages and clips sort of things before, but I don't really use the snipe as much. I'm not actually playing much at the moment. I haven't played in weeks. Probably about two weeks now. Um, not through my own choice, but just being busy and stuff. Haven't been able to play, which really sucks because I really enjoy playing. It's a major hobby of mine. Um, but yeah, I I mean, that's all I can say about that really. Um, all I can say about this gameplay really, I'm not really a gameplay channel, is that I'm using the MSMC. I enjoy using it. I'm using the score streaks I like a lot. UAV. Load, start, and swarm. I normally like to have the VSAT in instead. I don't think I'd unlocked it at the time. Um, I don't. I don't think the UAV is really necessary if you have the VSAT. So I, 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 I use the. I'm trying to think of what I would like to. I actually quite enjoy using the Hellstorm. So I probably use the Hellstorm missile, orbital VSAT, and um, escort drone. Th those are good. Those are a solid three, I think. But I think the VSAT's after the Escort Drone, so it'll be, the, it'll be a little bit different. It'll be a Hellstorm, Escort Drone, Orbital VSAT. And in fact, the Lodestar's very fun to use as well. So perhaps I could use Lodestar instead of Escort Drone. But then you can't run around when you're using that. So yeah, no, I'd, I'd use the Escort Drone. Just to, I prefer having manually done things. But I, I might change it up to the Lodestar once in a while because it's fun to use. But yeah. So there's only 40 seconds left of this now. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Um, I will do more videos like this, looking into, you know, the the problems with Call of Duty, what could be better, issues about whether, well, just relative facts. I, I mean, opinions, sorry, not really facts yet. Um, but I think they will turn out true. I, I think one of the two games, Advanced Warfare or Black Ops 3, will be good, I think. And I think if the, the games after that improve, then the franchise goes on strong. If the games don't improve, then uh, no, basically. But it's just an average gameplay. Hope you guys enjoyed um, playing the objective. I collected a lot of tags, um, as I always do. Okay, bye.